So first off, hope you guys staying safe out there. Welcome back to more Hitman 3. Loving this game. So this mission was a lot longer than expected, or at least the way I played it was a lot longer. So thank you guys for sticking with me. Uh, I'm going to tell you right now, so what I'll wind up doing... This is going to be a two-part one, obviously. This is the second part of it. But uh, thank you guys so much for all the support on this series. It's kind of cool starting the year off strong. This, you know, not a lot of big games right now. I don't even know if this is considered a big title. But all I know is I love it. I think the game is excellent. And uh, looking forward to finishing this one up. So you guys are amazing. Thanks for the likes. Let's get this. All right, guys. I'm just going to kind of run around. I think... The ultimate thing I want to do right now is find this form and get this other thing done. Um, so we got the apartment, so it was like the floor. Wait a minute. Wait, is that where I took those two guys out on the stairs? I can hop down, maybe get into that window. That's going to... Oh, that might be it. That might be the key we need. Hold on. Uh, problem is... Getting back through here is going to be a problem. This is right here. I'm not gonna hurt you, but I'm just gonna subdue you. Just you know, not gonna, not gonna take you out there, buddy. Let's try this. Yeah, that that might be the way I get out of here. Yeah, cause you, I don't think you're supposed to find no passcode, unless I'm wrong. You don't need to close this door. It's kind of risky. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, it's like back in here, I think. Wait a minute. Oh, it is. Wait a minute. Scale. Okay, here we go. Is there anybody in here? Okay, there's nobody in here right now. So we're gonna get to do like a story thing now. Nice. That's what I was wanting to do. Granted, there was probably two different ways you could have done it. Run the water. I. You know what I'm wondering? I'm kind of wondering if uh, sink and overflow. All the guards are down. And those are the ones that came to the lower floor, I'm pretty sure. So I have all them gone. Wait, what do we got here? Hearing answer machine. The person that I just took out below us might Hello, be the other Mr. person. Richard. I've just learned that your plane will be delayed beyond the lifetime of the entry code you received for the facility. For your convenience, we've set up the new code to be 0118 to match the one for the apartment. I hope you enjoy your stay. Hi, Chanting here. Mr. Pritchard, I'm just calling to tell you to bring your P41 for the facility tour. Thank you. Mr. Pritchard, I just read your report and share your concerns regarding facility leadership behavior. I fully back your decision to inspect, and I would appreciate updates on your initial findings as they come in. Good job. Oh, you got new menus. I had no idea. Uh, do you still have the... Sorry, what? Right, yeah. Uh, just some sparkling water is fine. So, do you... Oh, <laughs> right here. Yeah, so I'd like to get some soup dumplings. Right, sorry, yeah, with the crab. Uh, and how about some of those... Shit, what are they called? The, the crispy ones? Yes, those. Perfect. You know what? I'll get a double order. And uh, a plate of the Pork ones. Huh. Okay. Well, we got we got some of the intel. Disguise yourself as a board member. Hold on. Let me double check this really quick. Uh, yep. We got the form. All right. We're going back to the restaurant now. Or at least we got to get an, uh, another disguise. So, well, I don't know the best way to get over there, but I'm just going to go across the street. Yeah, I think... Anybody that would have came into that building would have actually been everyone I took out earlier. So that actually kind of worked out. All right, we're going back across, guys. Here we go. Back to the restaurant. That's kind of cool, man. I was worried. I was like, it's got to be something I'm missing because this code's not available. So clearly, I found it. We're good to go. Good evening. So I got to disguise myself as the board member, meaning that outfit right there. But how do we even get this outfit? That's what I want to know. Because this person's always there. The only thing I can think of is maybe poison the food. 
I don't know when he'll be blend in his apple before, dumpling cook. No, he's lost his luggage and wants to handle that first. Of course. I, I, oh, wait. Is he really a dumpling cook? Prepare. His hands are so soft. Oh, oh, never mind. Poison. Oh man, I just where do I hold on service? Man? Yeah, I gotta find poison, dude. It, everything boils down to just poison. Mom, you can't call me when I know what. Turn off the stove. Yes. Start late. They're gonna see that. It's in the middle of the night. That is too close. So you can prepare it. Go out there. You probably can serve it. Overflow the sink. There's gotta be some. Poison somewhere around here. Uh, man, this is tough. I'm gonna look out this window really quick. So many ways to do every level. I love it. Oh, yes, let's go, baby. What are the odds? Let's get it now. I'm about to climb back through. I got the poison. Y'all, I'm pumped right now. Let's get it. All right. Up and go. Easy. Oh, they took the food already. Oh, the person's walking around now. Oh, so they eat, and after they eat, they just leave. So, all right. That would have been perfect to be able to get that, dude. I need an update on how far you are locating my missing luggage. I'm asking you, do not put me on hold. This is just unbelievable. Yes, hello. I need to locate my luggage. It did not arrive at the destination. Don't you dare put me on hold. You hit shit. Gotta love pretentious people. <laughs> Don't you dare put me on hold. That would have been perfect. I was cooking the food. Oh, he's coming back. I could have poisoned it right there. I didn't realize that. Imagine poisoning it right in front of him. Alright, so my hope is the guy will eat or get another call. Now that I have the poison, I can take him out. Yes, it's tough. Uh, what do I do here? That's a little too close. Yeah, I don't know what to do here because it's like you can't really serve the guy twice. Hmm. All right, I have an idea, but I've got to reload my game. Which I really don't want to, but because I've been trying to avoid doing that. But or I might just see what he does. Maybe there's a way he'll actually move again. Anyways, I can't remember if I can only serve him once. So is he getting up? Please be another call. Oh, this guy's gone this time. He is gone, gone. Oh, he might be going back to his apartment or his uh, hotel or whatever that was we were in. It's got to be an apartment, right? A rental. Please don't go to the right. Going to the car, maybe? This is so cool. They don't mind us, just chilling. I mean, no one's around. No, don't. All right, we're good to go. Talk to the guide. 
Don't mind me. Just blending in. Nice. I thought I was only gonna have to be able to like poison the gun. There was been no way to otherwise do it. We got the outfit. Now we're headed back over this way. Yo, this is moving along quickly. Let's get it, man. I just love that there's two different ways you can go about it. I could go try to find the person I'm supposed to take out, take him out. Oh, that's the, uh... Yeah, I, I just passed her a minute ago. When I grabbed the poison and stuff. Hold on, let me go back. Go in the restaurant and you can actually go across. I, I knew she kind of seemed more like a key character because... She didn't quite... Like, she had a unique outfit compared to everyone else. Usually that's like a telltale sign, you know? We got some intel, though. Hold on, let me see what it says. Uh, one of the restaurant chefs seem to have lost a note with an access code on it, but what kind of restaurant requires a code for employees to get to work? Even. True. Can I go back there? Or this should attach to it, I'd imagine. Ooh, pass window. Uh, hold on. Can I just... I think we're good. I'm ready to inspect the facility now. Good. I hope you enjoyed the food. Did you bring the P-41 we left for you in the apartment? Yes. I have everything I need. Good. Let's continue the tour. Continue, you may say. We haven't even started the tour yet. But we have. Without you even noticing it, Mr. Pritchard. Invisibility is the best security there is. You see, the red is in fact a front that lets all ICA personnel arrive unseen. Who notices a dumpling cook on his way to work? Dressing the part takes you a long way. ICA guarantees absolute discretion to all clients. We take that promise very seriously, as you will see on all steps of the tour. Come on, it's this way inside. Huh. Interesting. I like how the rain was hitting me. Doesn't look like much, does it? It's on top of my head, you can see it actually moving. It's pretty Ms. cool. Chen and visitor, welcome. Please report to security desk for visitor sign in. Will do. This I is pretty cool. Facility AI is really looking out for us. And we're in. The inside is a self-contained modular build that can be disassembled and removed in less than 12 hours if we are compromised. No trace we will ever hear. I agree. Leaving no trace behind is the only sensible MO. The outside shell is a building marked for demolition. We've put a hold on it with city planning. A deliberate misplacement of the order but have people in place to rectify that. At first shift, city construction will move in. Hey. Our policy around ICA personnel uh, is that they are a resource, but also a risk. On top of contractual yeah, repercussions sorry. if breaches occur, we'll sure we perform detailed fire. vetting on everyone. Basket. The first, Thanks. blunt Thanks. vetting, is a Me risk. Too. We have, of course, never had any employees trying to bring us. I gotta get rid of this stuff now. Right weapons inside the facility, but we do consider them. Hold on. Uh, can I only drop one thing at a time? I got a lot of stuff. Yo, hold on. Let me save my game because I feel like I'm going to get frisked and they're going to take everything. Oh, no. Is there just one, like... This is not good. I can only drop one thing in there? They can see me, obviously, right? So... Can I... Can I put multiple things in there? Like, I have a dang gun. I have a katana. This is gonna be bad. Alright, if I fail, I gotta save, at least. There you are. Good. Let's continue the tour. I have an idea. Hold on. We have, of course, never. Alright. I don't care about this now. Hold on, let's see. Hold on, let me... 
You can just drop this stuff, right? I'm just gonna drop everything I have that's lethal. <laughs> no reason for me to have all this stuff on me right now. Uh, well, this... A medic. I don't know if that's... Will that be the thing? I feel like that might be the thing that gets me spot. Okay. We're gonna leave all that there. It's weird you can, like, put one thing in there. Alright, I should be fine now. Mr. Pritchard, you're back. Let's continue. Don't mind me just dropping all my illegal weapons. Hi. Yeah, we keep have, it real. Of course, never so if you want to pass through, I need to, to check that you're not carrying anything dangerous. The facility, but we do consider the step Funny. important. My mother always said I had good hands. Said I should have been a surgeon. Here, Mr. Thank you for your patience, sir. All right. I need your P41 to start the clearance procedure. Check pockets. I've already been frisked, so. Thanks. Or frisked. I'll get the procedure started. It'll just be a few moments, so feel free to have a look around. I'll meet you on the other side of the frisk. Naturally, you'll have to be frisked like everyone else. No exceptions, Mr. Pritchard. If you want to pass through, I gotta pat you down. We're doing it again, huh? Yeah, let me take a look. Just like the movies, right? And you so, have to go, sir. Thank you. Well, she's right there. Wait. There's no way you're getting through that door 47. It only opens for people with an authentic security clearance. The signal is encrypted. Without a dongle, we can't hack it. Okay, so there's a whole new outfit, a whole new set of outfits I could possibly get back here. Yo, I'm gonna tell you, like... Let me take a picture here, too. Good, you're here. I've started the security clearance process. It will take a little while since you're covered by the Zero Protocol. All your data will be encrypted and inaccessible without your authorization. Only Facility AI will use it for ID analysis. Fully anonymized, of course. But we can go a few more steps on the tour while it's validating. ID analysis? What the hell does that mean? Give me a minute. I'll try to find out. Well, whatever it is, it doesn't sound good, and it sounds like I'm about to get spotted, so I gotta As be careful. As I said, personnel is the greatest asset, but also the greatest risk of the ICA. The work Target's right we do there. here exerts high-level pressure on our employees, and there is no room for mistakes. We perform a daily, multi-layered, full-body scan to guarantee that no employee will act erratically because of PTSD or other mental issues, drug use, physical health issues, external pressure, or moral hesitancy. The scan only takes a few seconds. Let's step inside. Uh, should I not be listening to... Well, here we go. I'm sorry, but we can't proceed beyond this room until your security clearance is finalized. So, why don't you have a little look around while we wait, Mr. Pritchard? It should be here shortly. Shit. We need to intercept that 47, or the facility AI will blow your cover. Get me into one of those computers and do it fast. You've got 60 seconds before all hell breaks loose. Oh my god. What computer? And how are you today, sir? Oh wait, right here. You can hack. use your camera to hack that panel. Yo, we gotta, we gotta move, dude. This is quick. Access granted. What? Dude, whatever. Let's go. Oh my god. Good. I'm in. And you're safe. <sighs> that was a close one. Security protocol overruled. Okay. Think we're good. How about that rain? Perfect timing. 
Your clearance just came through. Let's continue. So, as you see, we are very serious about security. What we protect is, after all, core to all ICA operation. We, and we alone, store all legal hey. work, contracts, target profiles, employee files, contract documentation and validation, and so forth. Furthermore, we handle all current operations, effectuate logistics or personnel and equipment. Our analysts do the client vetting, target profiles, and of course, offer real-time contract support to handlers and operators. There's the person. Storage and transmission of sensitive information like that takes constant Division vigilance Royce. to keep safe. We have a team of engineers solely dedicated to that task. And on top of that, we have a dual human authentication. Oh, good. There she is. That's Imogen Royce. Quite the bitch, apparently. Nothing wrong with her look, though. Hi, Imogen Royce. Edgy. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Likewise. What? This is like big, man. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is, this is huge. This might be it. I don't know. The data core is in here. After Hack you. data core unavailable. Eliminate last target. Yo, this is nuts. This We're is here. This is the blast and EMP shielded call room. The nervous system of the ICA. Where we store the past and facilitate the present. In general, only a handful of people can access this room. Hush and myself, plus bodyguards, and a chosen few of the engineers. I'm the most likely person to meet in here because I perform a regular physical check-in on the core console as a supplement to the remote authentication procedure. This is crazy. It's about to we go have down, hopefully. a strict hopefully. routine of daily core maintenance. Part of that procedure is a flash process evaporating all biological matter in the room. You can see Reed through that window. It's her job to initiate the maintenance. Don't worry, we're safe as long as the safety mechanism is engaged. Even if Reed presses the button, the procedure will not happen until we leave the core room. The doors to the core room are all equipped with... You know what, screw this tour. I know why you're really here. Cunning to the chase, I see. Knowledge is power. More importantly, knowledge is opportunity. Let me demonstrate. You have a sixth sense for irregularities. And although Hush's recent behavior has not been reported, it has no doubt brought you here. You do have authority to shut down unwanted efforts, but at heart, you are progressive and not the stickler everyone thinks you are. You have sway with the board, and as I see it, your opinion is now what decides my future and the future of the ICA. So here we go. Imagine this. Having a time schedule on a target with minute details on locations, durations, and purpose. A detailed layout of a target's actions within a defined time frame. That would transform a contract into a surgical dance of precision. No mess, no fuss, low cost. Just how I like it. I've been working on a prediction algorithm based on a combination of big data analysis and micro-targeted surveillance of defining target markers and my results are astounding. All this state of the art is nothing but heavy old fashioned machinery compared to what I offer. Analysts preparing detailed files, dedicating days, weeks to prepare our contracts, gone. Handlers and analysts supporting our operatives during missions, gone. Teams for cleanup and media manipulation in the rare case something unforeseen does happen, all of it, gone. I asked you to imagine that scenario. But what good is imagination when you can see it with your own eyes? I've set up a little demonstration for you. Three employees unaware that I can accurately predict their behavior. Firing them will result in an already clearly defined reaction. On the top left, we have Sharon Reed, who you saw downstairs. She is a dutiful and trusted employee. If she is to be fired, my algorithm predicts with a certainty of 97.8% that she will finish up her most important tasks before she leaves the building. Specifically, she will press the maintenance button within 11 seconds. Jeremy Bolt. The guard in the lower left is as tough as nails when on duty, but in private, he's a real mummy's boy. If fired, he will immediately call his mother and at her advice, seek out who he considers his best friend for support. My personal guard, as it stands. Me? Really? Well, that explains why he's always next to me at lunch. At the top right, you see Alicia Reynolds. Bright and very passionate about her job. However, 
also very possessive about her contribution. My prediction is that she will try to disable the work she has done for the ICA. If she's not allowed to enjoy her results, no one is. Specifically, that means she will try to enter the call room and disable the safety mechanism. I'll leave you to consider your choice of who you want me to use for the demonstration. Just let the guard outside the door know when you're ready, and I'll be right back. I will have a closer look. Maybe your project could play a part in the future of the ICA. Just let the guard outside the door know when you're ready, and I'll be right back. Oh, and if you decide to leave the room, a guard will escort you around. Safety protocol. Thought I'd just mention it. She really takes the term God complex to a whole new level. Sitting in there pulling the strings like that. I think you should take her setup and give it a spin, 47. I see potential if you time it right. Well, I don't really know what to quite do here, because... I mean, we got to use the terminal and pick, right? Um... Leaves core entrance. Oh, that might be good. Hold on. Disable. This might be the one, right? Safety mechanism. That sounds like it could be helpful. Wait, did I not select? Let's see. Uh, here we go. Alicia Reynolds. I regret to inform you that Code 41 is now effective for your employment status. Don't mind me, sir. Thank you for I'll your service. I'll be you around. Procedure. I was partially hoping that uh, this story mission would end with us being able to somehow take her out. I really can't do anything. Um, hold on. I can take a picture of this and hack. Oh, yeah. I'm ready to see Royce now. I'll let her know. I could yeah, hack he's this. Ready to see you. Let me just double check really quick. Was, was he even actually do anything? Access denied. Oh, encryption key needed. You don't have to open this door. door. Jesus. Door. That's a lot. She's coming back, so I okay. Here's the thing: how do I how do I take her out though? I don't know. I gotta hack the data core still. Guess we gotta go back to the same room and talk first. I don't know. I like her outfit. I'm just kind of wondering, like, how this is all going to tie together in the end. Because the whole point of a story mission sometimes is to actually be able to assassinate the person at the end of it. This one, it seems, have already completed it. But now we're kind of... I don't know. We're kind of just doing other stuff now. You've had a closer look and made your choice of who to let go? I have. I'll let you have the honors and be the one to perform the demonstration. Go ahead and choose the subject. The facility AI will handle the situation. You just enjoy the show. Okay. I mean, do I take her tablet or... You go for the drama, I see. Don't worry, it's quite safe. The guard will prevent her from doing any damage. Are we get to pick other one? Hold on. Yes, why not? Notice the precise time estimates in the prediction. It should match within a 3% margin. What about Jeremy Bolt, I regret to inform you that Code 41 is now effective for your employment status. Thank you for your service. Code oh, 41 is confirmed. Let's see. Uh... Okay, this is how you get it. Okay, I so I've already just been firing everybody, so... Make sure to arrange a secondary bodyguard before firing. These are just notes. Okay, so maybe... Effective for your employment status. Hmm. Okay. Can we just fire everybody? Imagine. The dutiful one. <laughs> You've got a mean streak, Mr. Pritchard. Sharon Reed. I regret to inform you that Code 41 is now effective for your employment status. Thank you for your service. 
I mean, are we good? We can't really do anything else. Oh, you mean Vincent? Yeah. Yeah, I'll go see him then. Okay, I'll call you later. I trust you're convinced by the demonstration and agree that this is the future for the ICA. I mean, how could you not? So, you'll probably want to dive into the project documentation and write your recommendations right away. You're free to use my office. I'll tell the guard outside to escort you out of the facility when you're done. I'm looking forward to upscaling my project. Goodbye, Mr. Pritchard. We're escorting you around. Procedure. Code 41 oh. is confirmed effective for your employment Hold on. status. Oh my goodness. This is the way. This is the way. Hold on. We can ask to see her now. Oh, this is perfect. All right, I think I know what I want to do Alicia now. Alicia Reynolds, I regret to inform you that Code 41 is now effective for your employment status. Thank you for your service. All right, let's ask to see her one more time. Why isn't the thing popping up? Wait, wait. I'm ready to see Royce now. I'll let her know. I'll tell the guard outside to escort you out of the facility when you're done. They didn't hear that. All right. Both targets down. Good. Just give me a second. And I'm in. You can now access the core 47. You can't put her back there? Where do I put her? Oh, no. Um, Drop here. I can access the core. Hold on, hack. Oh, it's down there. Okay, here's my worry. I have nowhere to hide this body. Like, nowhere. So I'm gonna go through this way. Okay, before I go in there, I am definitely saving because we did everything we need to. We handled business. No one cares. Okay. Nice. The core is back here and then we're going to hack in here. That was clean. I was worried how I was going to do that or not, you know? It's on the other side. Please let me pass. The flashy core maintenance are working like magic. So much faster than the previous system. I wish I had Sharon's job. It looks so cool. Is this it? I guess I could hack this. But do I have to have some kind of clearance? Security protocol overruled. Good. You're alone. I'm sealing the room and dimming the windows for myself. No need to worry about intruders. This is so awesome. It's all here. Clients, operatives, every hit the ICA ever sanctioned. Enough to shut them down for good. But first you need to locate all files referencing Diana and yourself. limitation I choose him the two of you go way back I didn't realize that you I don't know I get why you want to protect her so wipe all the data referring to the two of you from their system before we publish the rest all right deleting files let's go 
Right, it's kind of cool we're able to do this. Getting out of here is going to be problematic, I feel like. <laughs> okay, good. I've set up a link to an information non-profit site. When you press that button, it's up there and the whole world will know. There's no undo 47. This will shut the ICA down for good. You really okay with this? It's who you've been for so long. I mean, there's no going back. Let's go. Maybe it's time for a change. I'll just return things to normal. No need to alert them we were here prematurely. Detected. Lockdown commencing. Uh oh. Shit. I missed that. We're blown 47. I can hold the doors for a little while. Use the vents to get out. Go now. Oh my god. Breach protocol Fence. initiated. This is bad. That means they'll shoot on sight. I'm gonna create some havoc 47. Make the core meltdown. Maybe we'll divert their attention a bit. Warning. Where, core overheating. Where do I even go? Warning. All this stuff is like core can I go in with down. water? That'd be nice. Temperature Submerge critical. myself. Okay, the exit. I mean, yeah, where am I gonna do that at? Everything is locked down. Um Oh wait, oh my god, here we go. Out of here, out of here. I didn't even see this. Warning, fire detected. This is so bad. Oh my god, what am I supposed to do? I'm gonna burn alive down here. Wait, let's go this way. This is probably one of the best missions in Hitman's last three games. It's incredibly well done. Oh my Man. god. Yeah, I'm here now. It's all clear. Over. What am I... How? How, Sway? Hold on. I'm supposed to do what? Just walk out there and get shot? I don't... Hold on. This is... There's no hiding. You know? Man, I got nothing. Stand by. Oh man, this is so bad. All personnel, breach protocol initiated. Command area is all clear. Breach five, over. I'm so nervous. Warning. I mean core overheating. Two people there. This is bad. This is real bad. Um, All personnel, breach protocol initiated. Can I take the thing? This might be my only chance out of here. Nope, they still think I'm. Okay, well, never mind then. Um, the problem is, everybody knows. Oh, this is rough, dude. What's that, Command? Okay, continuing search. Warning core overheating. So, what do I do? Oh, my God. Roger, Command. Nothing tangible yet. Still looking. I mean, I might just have to start shooting, to be honest. I was hoping I wouldn't have to, but I might not have a choice. I'm gonna get spotted here. Warning. Fire detected. I got nothing on the stairs. Out. So this outfit doesn't even matter. So that's good to know. Over. All personnel. Come on, look the other way, dude. Initiated. This might be my way out. See a ladder. Area clear. Isn't this just gonna take me back in that room? Yeah. Ah, oh, it's not good, dude. This is all kinds of bad. There's I have nowhere I can actually go and be safe. We can go up. 
Ouais, ouais, ouais. That's like right over here. Warning, core overheating. I can't go through there, really. Man, got nothing. Stand by. This is so stressful. It's different playing Hitman when they already know, like, you shouldn't be there. You know what I mean? And the minute, doesn't matter what kind of outfit you have, they're going to start shooting at you. I'm going to take this banana and throw it at somebody. Band, I've got some report from my current location. This is tough, dude. I, I mean, fire detected. Man, what do I do, guys? What's that command? Okay, continuing search. What is the package doing? Roger, command. Nothing tangible yet. Still looking. Will do. Out. Hmm. Nothing at my position. All right, I'm going through here. Probably a dumb idea, but got to find a way out of here, right? And hey, what is this? Hold on. I can loosen this up. All it's not going to take us to the exit, though. Breach protocol Double initiated. item in the bed. Okay. Uh, let me save my game just because I feel like I've made a good chunk of progress getting up to this area. Roger, command. Nothing tangible yet. Still looking. Will do. Out. This is so stupid. What am I doing? Nothing at my position. Exit's right over there. I said, like, what are you supposed to do? Warning. Core overheating. Area clear. Proceeding to next sector. Please follow the other guy. Please follow the other guy. Please. Do what you gotta do. Nothing here, command. Moving on. Moving on, are we? How are you gonna say you're moving on and just stand there? Killing me. Man, this is tough, man. I don't like. There's no surefire way to like, because I know that if I start getting shot at, it's over. Uh, man, yeah, I'm here now. It's all clear. Over. <laughs> oh. Warning. Fire detected. Yo, is that? Oh my god. Thank you. We're out of there. I was worried the entire level was going to be like that once we got outside and everything. We're done. Thank god. That was tough, dude. Alright, we're out. Woo, that was a tough one. Alright, nice. All my stuff doesn't matter because I was offline. That's good to know. We turn now to the data leak bombshell causing shockwaves across the world. The so-called ICA files. The disclosure of... You win. So. What happens now? The ball's in your court, Miss Burnwood. I do have other candidates, you know. Most of whom have never tied me to a chair. You've seen the news. That was 47 acting on his own. He is untethered, he is unstoppable, and he cannot be bargained with. He will find you, Mr. Edwards, and I'm the only chance you've got. 
I'm listening. 47 has one weakness. Me. All right, that was awesome. All right, the farewell is next. Let's go ahead and exit to the main menu. I'm actually curious, like, how many more missions. I think we got two more left. I don't know why it does this. All right. Let's see. Uh, yep. We did. Okay, we just finished that one. We watched the cutscene. The farewell. So we have the farewell cutscene and then untouchable and then new deal. All right, that is it for now. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll come back next time. We'll continue the main story. We have two main missions left. And, uh, man, let me tell you, so when there's two targets, it takes you a long time, like, per target. I thought it would be just, like, a phase. Like, maybe I was bad at the game originally when, like, the first Hitman came out. I was like, man, it takes me a while to get these kills, you know? But then, in Hitman 2, was the same way. And in this one, it's identical to that. So, it's just kind of how, how it is. I think it's kind of awesome that they have, uh, so much detail in such a small section of each game. You know, like, each, uh... Each mission, there might be six or seven total actual levels, but each one's, like, packed with stuff you can do. So, all right, guys. Love you. Best audience ever. I will catch you on the flip side. Stay classy out there, guys. Peace.